Yeah, I mean, honestly, that that one is closer than the others, I guess. We can, I think we can rehearse with everything today that they were, that we were given, except that part where the ball, me and Adam are playing catch with the ball. It's going to be, we, we have to do it, but it's going to be hard to rehearse knowing where the ball is going to be for that. So they're almost setting it up, and then it's to you and Adam. How do we create a visual to something that's so stimulating through audio? So we thought, this is a good break where me and Adam can have our moment together, where we're building up to something. With our drums. Paint is falling. We collect the paint. I play. And then all of a sudden, blackout and explodes. Your lights go out and you're done. Yeah, we can do Somebody tested, can you hear me? Somebody here tested positive. And we had this crazy lockdown procedure initiated where everyone was separated out and every single person got tested. And luckily so far, everybody else is negative. The positive person was rushed out of the building into quarantine, and now they're just staying in their hotel room. Okay. Ready? So after Adventures Out There is three o'clock things. Um, that is where Jack goes on the treadmill. Um, I think they dialed in a lot of the automation last night after we left. We uh, did. There's, there's going to be very small tweaks, but all the, it's all dialed in on time codes. So the second you guys hit go, it'll be tweaking that time mm -hmm. code set, but it's not near as inaccurate as I was when I was on Do the Do you mean that's, that there's no one actually starting the treadmill. So the, it's all fired through time code, and what, right. what Andrew does through the navigation system, like we did on One Spectacular Night, is he just holds a safety to say, yes, you can fire off of time code. Mr. Lead Singer, sir, you drop these. I got it. I know you're so busy being an artist. Oh. Can I talk to you for a sec? Uh, you need these for show? Um, I, I had nothing planned for this moment, and I'm trying to find the words. Uh, 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 this is our first real you know, headline show in two years, and I'm sure a lot of you, yeah. Um, and I'm sure a lot of you, uh, this is your first show that you've been to in two years, so it's a very rare moment to wear um, it's, it's, it's a really rare moment where artist and fan at the same level, on the same page, experiencing something together for the first time. It's a really, it, it's rare if not, you know, ne ne never exists. Um, so uh, let's cherish this moment. Let's experience this night together. This is really, really exciting to have you guys here. Thank you so much. Let's do this one. <laughs> Welcome to the orchestra. Let's do it again. Yeah, go ahead. On the album? I really like the, if you're fucking racist, don't come to my show. I think that, <laughs> <laughs> I, I just think it works so well in the context. And you'll see tonight, like we did the, our first headline show last night and the whole crowd goes, if you're fucking racist, it's just like the best feeling ever. It's not me, but there's something I know that if you're fucking racist, then don't come to my show.
do you feel? Uh, I just woke up from a nap, so I feel like uh, I'm, I'm easing into it. It's cut, making cut, it. Cut. Uh, uh, Come on. Oh, that's oh. it. That's oh. it. Hey. hey! It's pretty obvious. Colder. <laughs> Warmer. Ha! <laughs> Yeah. I've been on my get back, cop a bag slow. You would never see that. Use the trap though. Chop it up with you. Like I've been on morning and one of our guys tested positive for COVID so all morning we've been testing everybody I'm literally the last person to be tested everybody's negative and now we find out if we could put on this show tonight I think the latter are we calling it we're calling it yeah it was negative baby it was a show. dentist in three years. Oh god, why? Just let me do the bit without you in it, Adam. Whipping his hair into the shot. Let's change the style of the horror doc so that you cut to, I whip my hair back for and a gif of Adam whipping his hair. <laughs> and hopefully I can fall and you can go, you know. Hey, you know what it's like to go on tour? And then you, oh, and then it fully covers the thing and then it goes out and there's like a million screws. 
Yeah, you do a wipe to the next scene. Well, we're going to go through every one of Brian's clothing. He's the clothing until we get to it. You want to know what it's like to be on tour? Oh! It was perfect! <laughs> We spent about a week rehearsing here in pre-production, and now we did most of our tour, and now we're back here, kind of a homecoming thing, the closest thing to New York City on this tour. So we're kind of doing a hometown show here in Connecticut. Yeah, you... And then the song is fading out. And it's like, that's just so catchy. And so we've, we've been living with that for a while, and we thought, okay, there's gotta be a way we can use it. Ready, fast forward, uh, it's 10 years or so, we were writing a song for Cardi B, and uh, we ended up making this track. You'll hear it's a little bit of a faster tempo. It's coming, get ready. And what's funny is the next song she put out after that was WAP. So we, we realized like, oh, we were probably not on the same page as Cardi B at all. Um, oh man, I'm, I'm really nervous. <laughs> Don't be nervous, go ahead. Oh, I'm just really excited for today. It's the first concert I've been to since I saw you guys at Radio City in like 2019. Oh, so. awesome. Nice. Yeah. Oh, well thanks for coming back. I'm excited to see what you think of the yeah. comparison. Yeah, pretty yeah. yeah. different show. Yeah, pretty, yeah, tweet us later. I will. <laughs> it <laughs> was worse. It was worse. <laughs> yeah, we'll take it. <laughs> Hopeless case and resolve to love. Maybe we can find a decent place when I'm old enough. Found love in an empty case. Try to fix it up. I found me a hopeless case. Oh. Jaguars, 0-4, oh should've had me on the team. Jaguars, 0-4, oh should've had me on the team. <laughs> so we first put up this tour what, two months ago? Yeah, and that's a lie. Right? Yeah, that's a very short amount of time to plan an entire tour, conceptualize all the effects, go on sale. We weren't really sure that this tour would actually play. And to come out and see all these packed venues in markets that we've never played before uh, is kind of unbelievable.
you think it can be done? Boom, baby! <laughs> <laughs>